Well, if you thought some of these other teams we've highlighted lost a lot of players, meet the Roseau Rams. They lost seven seniors last year. You can only fit six on a court, but they're hard at work to get right back to where they want to be. I think it's um, a younger team, but I think it's going really well, and we have we do have the skill level, but we're all still learning. The Rams are loaded with multi-sport athletes, which makes practices ultra competitive. We have a team full of athletes. There are girls who play uh, basketball, hockey, uh, track, softball, golf, and so they're just competitors, and it's a good it's a good thing. Um, and they respect each other enough to know it's only making themselves better. Rosa is looking to make winning section titles an annual event instead of just once every 17 years. It had been a long time since Rozo has had made it to the state volleyball tournament, and I think that kind of fueled the fire for a few girls this summer, too, of just wanting to not let that be a one time and done and just get back and be competitive and try to go for it again. This year, it's obviously a goal to try to get back there and show some of these younger girls what it's like. Right off the bat for the Rams, a rematch of the Section 8 2A title game against Park Rapids. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.